Now, President Ekufuado on Tuesday cut sod for the construction of the 300-meter Volta Rail Bridge at Oguli in the North Tong district of the Volta region. Now, the rail bridge, which spans Senchi to Mpakand, forms part of the 93-kilometer Tema Mpakadan rail project, which is being constructed by AFCON's Infrastructure Limited with funding from Indian Exim Bank. Now, speaking before the sod cutting, President Ekufuadu indicated completion of the Temampakadan rail project would facilitate exploitation of natural resources deposited along the rail network and, of course, transform the country's economy. Line from Tema to Wagadu is going to continue from Japan. Begins in Tema, the country drop off, and then go up to Wagadu. It's going to make Drago a very important railway town in this entire area in the very near future. The proposed investment that is coming will transform not just the area, but the entire Volta region. The procurement is, is, is ongoing. And if everything goes smoothly, the strategic partner to join the two countries of Ghana and Burkina to construct the rail line will be chosen next year in 2020. The line will go through Volta, Oti, North, Northeast, and Upper East regions. And it will afford us the opportunity to make a great deal of our iron ore deposits in Shane. Already, we are, we've set up a public corporation that is going to be responsible for mobilizing the resources to exploit and develop the Shane deposits. The railway line that is going to be put in place is going to make that development even more feasible and efficient. The modern standard gauge net railway network which we have been de which we have developed is going to transform the entire nation. Sections of the narrow gauge are being rehabilitated and construction of the new standard gauge has begun here as well as in the Fortune region. Next year, more projects are going to be initiated and commenced. Now, still on railways, the Minister for Railway Development, Joe Gatte, has assured that the first 100 kilometers of the Ghana Burkina Faso railway line will be completed by August 2020. Speaking at the Meet the Press series in Accra today, the Minister said the project, if completed, will enhance our position as the center of African trade. As I'm concerned, the 800 kilometer line, the first 100 kilometers, which is the, um, the Tema Impakadan section of it will complete next year by August. It is my prayer, and I say it is my prayer because uh, railway development is, is fought with banana peels that anything can happen at any time that will unexpectedly derail your project. But it is my prayer that by the time we finish the construction of this line in August 2020, we would have already chosen the contractor and would have commenced construction of the remainder of the line to Agadugu, uh, with our section being now from Drapo to uh, Pada. Mr. Gate also noted that the government will soon pay compensation packages to those who have been affected by the construction of the railway lines in various parts of the country. Um, like all other areas, uh, we, we estimate an amount for compensation. Rule of thumb, uh, maximum 10% of the cost of the project, sometimes even less. What we estimate the amount is an estimate. Because unless you've gone onto the ground, you cannot tell for sure how much compensation you have to pay. And also don't forget that we don't value the property. The valuation is done by last commission. What we do is that we make an amount available in the budget of the of the district. And we we sometimes we don't want to make it too public because it's like if you are going to buy something from somebody and you tell him beforehand the budget you have 
uh, to buy the thing. If you are not careful, that's the price you sell the thing to you at. So sometimes, in the interest of the people of Ghana, we don't want to say the exact amount we have uh, to pay compensation. Because I'm sure some of the people who are looking for compensation are listening with rapt attention. If I mention a figure, they say, hey, the people they have money, we have to take it up. So the compensation is in the budget. The valuation is by uh, the Ministry of um, um, Grant and Natural Resources and its agencies. And we are prepared to pay compensation where compensation is due. If you are a trespasser, I beg. If you are a trespasser, I, I regret to say that compensation may not be due.